Is it possible to edit downloaded sounds from other websites such as 808 Bass in certain notes? I want to change the bass notes to others and incorporate them into a song. So yeah, depending on the software you're using. So if we return over here to GarageBand, you can't do that. What you can if you've got, so if I'm using this funky bass here, you can actually change it here. If you go to your settings uh, with an Apple loop, click. With an Apple loop, you can actually uh, transpose it. So if I wanted to say bring this down like eight semitones, uh, I can do that. And then when we play back this track, The other thing that you could do is to use your follow tempo and pitch. So if we um, if we bring this back up to here, with the follow tempo and pitch enabled, we can come in here to our settings and the same thing in GarageBand for Mac and a lot of other things that you can actually follow the tempo and pitch. Let's say we want to take it from C to A flat major. Well, then we can do that. And now it's going to change it there. So that's a couple of ways to go. If you're in iOS and you're using GarageBand and you've got your own audio, so let's just say I've downloaded, because this is what you're asking about, I've downloaded, say, this organ track from, which I did get, I got this from freesound.org, very cool place to get yourself some free sounds, funnily enough, freesound.org. <laughs> Well, first of all, you can hear there that it's actually at a different BPM. This is at 100 BPM. So the first thing I'd have to do is change my tempo of my track here to go down to 100 BPM so that it would actually match the... Uh, match the tempo there. And then the other thing is once we come into here, you'll notice we don't have those same settings options because external audio can't be tempo mapped or can't be pitch changed. So what you would need to do is that the app that I use, and I've got video here, if you search for it, is an app called Audio Stretch. Uh, that's that's the easiest way that I've found to just change it. So uh, Audio Stretch, there's a pro version and a free version, I think. There you go. Uh, audio, oh, that's Audio Master, Audio Stretch. Uh, so the light version and, and the full version. So with this one, you can adjust the speed, but here's what you want. You can adjust the pitch. So you can do that same up and down semitone thing here. Uh, hit play. Or we can bring it up. Now this is a drum beat, so it doesn't really make much sense, but we'll bring it back up there and... <laughs> right? So yeah, you can do that and then you can export this sound, drop it back into GarageBand and you'll be good to go. So search my name, Pete Johns, and uh, Audio Stretch and you'll see the full uh, audio stretch video and demonstration there.